Hey what's up guys this is iPhone Dev Tips here and I'm here with again a new video tutorial and this time it's gonna be pretty amazing because today we're gonna to take a look at the new social framework that is you know recently uh, uh, built for iOS 8 so today in this video tutorial we're gonna learn how can we you know share our uh, personal text images and other stuff to Facebook Twitter okay so there's a separate video on how to share uh, on Instagram because Apple doesn't provide uh, you know the ability to I mean in the social framework to uh, to share on Instagram so that's a separate tutorial covered on that so you can view that so let's just dump into Xcode and create the uh, extra project so uh, let's just create a new extra project and it's again going to be a single view application and click next and let's just name the uh, Product or the app name to be, for example, iShare, and then uh, let the device to be iPhone and language to be Swift basically. And our object, Objective C, so it's Swift. And I'm gonna create a project. So here we are. So, just like in all my tutorials, how I began uh, is by changing the simulator from iPhone 6 to iPhone 5S, then going into main dot storyboard and disabling the size classes so by going in the file inspector over here and click on the use size classes I mean and it's gonna disable that so before doing that just make sure that the keep size class data for is set to iPhone and not iPad it's set to iPhone and then click disable size classes so it bring, brings you this this um, you know small the controller just like an iPhone 5 size okay now just directly jump into it so I'm just gonna uh, do some a uh, little bit of editing to the color so um, this is the color that I just uh, was founding out on the you know the other color option so I'm just gonna put a custom background color you can put what, uh, whatever I prefer then I'm going to add a button so where is it, where is it? yeah here it is so I'm gonna, I'm gonna add two button one for sharing on Facebook and one for sharing on uh, Twitter so first one Facebook and then I'm gonna copy uh, this button by pressing command C and pasting it by pressing command V so we have another button so I'm just gonna drag that and change the text to share on Twitter okay now let's just do some additional styling so what, what we can do basically is um, start with the share on Facebook button so I'm just gonna click on that and inside the attribute inspector Go scroll down and then you have an option over here in the view section so if you just kind of scroll down and then you have an option in the view section just to change the background color which is set to none I mean no color so I'm just gonna change the background color to white so it gives me this nice effect so this is what we're gonna do basically so this at least looks better and then we're gonna do the same in here with the uh, share on Twitter button just, so just scroll down and change the background color to white okay so once you do that just, let's just kind of center these up and yeah here it is okay then I'm gonna go into viewcontroller.swift and declare two IB outlets so uh, sorry not IB outlets it's IB actions so I'm just gonna basically scroll down go down in here and just uh, declare two IB actions one for uh, the share on Facebook button and one for share on Twitter button so I'll start with share on Facebook so I'm just gonna simply say IB action func it's this uh, function then share to Facebook and uh, uh, then these parentheses and then open brackets close brackets so then uh, I'm gonna add another IB action just as I told for the share to Twitter and uh, just do the same like uh, mean the parentheses and the open brackets close brackets so once you do that go to your main dot storyboard and click on the view controller so that it highlights blue then go into uh, the connections inspector and now we have the two actions that he created so starting with share to Facebook so I'm just gonna click on this plus icon to drag the blue line and drag the blue line to the button and click on touch up inside let's do the same with share to Twitter click on the plus icon then it's gonna give you this blue line uh, and then drag it over the share on Twitter button and make sure this is touch up inside cool so 
Once it did that, you would see these two dots are filled up with a another black dot inside. So, but if you do not do this, this, this would just kind of be an empty dot. Okay. So this was actually just to tell you that, but um, just to make sure that uh, this, uh, you know, that you have connected. So. Uh, go into your generals, I mean the general page by just clicking on here. Now, from this general, you have several options in here, okay? So, it's several tabs in here, and you have capability, capabilities, info, build settings, build faces, and build rules. So, we're going to go to build faces. So, we have four options here target dependencies, compile sources, link binary, uh, binary with libraries, and copy bundle resources. So, you want to go to link binary with resources. So, from here, we have this plus icon. So, if you just click on it, then a pop over appears. Then inside the search option, you want to search for the social framework. So here it is. So if you just search for social, we have this. And now just click over it and click on the add option to add the social framework. Okay. So uh, it's here. The social framework has been added to our project. Now go back to view controller dot swift. Okay. And go up here just below the import UI kit and now we want to import social so just type in import social okay so once you do that just go down here and just start programming for the uh, share to Facebook button so I'm gonna start by creating a share to Facebook view so which is just the uh, you know the pop over that comes so I'm gonna type in var variable share to Facebook uh, and it's gonna be a SL compose view controller which means social composing view controller so where you compose uh, you know the tweet or a Facebook uh, post or something so then you're gonna uh, initialize this in here only so you're gonna say social compose view controller and these parentheses then inside this it has a property called as for service type okay so this is the property so the for service type property would have this so it's gonna be SL service type and since we are programming for Facebook I'm gonna click on Facebook okay so what this basically means is we're gonna create a we're gonna create a SL compose view controller it's just basically a social compose view controller where you type in your Facebook post if you are doing for it for Facebook and for uh, you know tweeting if you're doing it for Twitter and then you're gonna initialize it by just saying SL compose view controller and these parentheses and inside the parentheses we have a, pr a parameter for SL compose view controller in which we can set what type of uh, you know uh, post you wanna do for uh, which is for example Facebook or Twitter so uh, since we are doing this for the Facebook because this is a shared Facebook button you're gonna type in for service type and inside the you know the what type of uh, SL service we're gonna type in SL service type Facebook okay so this is it then I'm gonna uh, just self I'm just gonna present the view controller so I'm gonna say share to uh, so I'm going to say self that present view controller and inside this the first one would be the view controller to present so which is share to Facebook animated would be true and uh, completion would be nil okay. now let's just program for the share to Twitter so I'm just going to simply say this is the same code so I'm going to say more share to Twitter this time it's not again going to be a SL compose view controller and now we're going to initialize this again and uh, put the parentheses and again the parameter for service type in which we set the service type mean for which thing you are for which service you are posting so it's going to be SL service type Twitter because we're posting for Twitter in this then you want to present by the view controller by saying self dot present view controller the view controller to be presented which is shared to Twitter and the uh, completion or sorry the animation would be a boolean so it's going to set to true and the completion is going to be nil okay so let's just test this on my iPhone 5s uh, simulator so before doing this just make sure that uh, you know uh, you have the uh, account uh, info entered into your simulator so I'm just going to show you how you can do that so if you just 
uh, go into your settings app which is over here into the in the in the simulator you have two options Twitter and Facebook so you can click on that and here you need to in, uh, write in your app details since I've already did that uh, 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 so the you know the ad uh, the account option doesn't appear so same things for Facebook even uh, in here you need to type in the uh, you know the uh, account information and it's gonna sign in you so I've just created two demo accounts. So in Twitter, I'm just gonna name it apps uh, underscore sample, and Facebook, I named it Dev John. So now let's just run this again. We run this again. So here's the app. So we can click on the share on Facebook button, and this is our uh, you know the SL Compose controller that I was talking about. So this appears. Then I'm gonna write a post. Hello, uh, hello. This is. Ah, this is my first Swift app, and then uh, you could, uh, you know, add in uh, separate informations like I mean, you know, extra information, not separate extra information like uh, you know who the audience would be, uh, who the lo where's the location from where where you're typing, and other stuff. Okay, so I'm just gonna post that. Oh, I'm sorry, by mistake they cancelled, so I'm just going to retype in hello. This is my first Swift app. Hooray. Okay. And now, if you just click on post, it's going to post, okay? Now, if you just go into my uh, Facebook account and just go into news feed. Here's the message for hello. This is oh, here it is. Hello, this is my first Swift app. Hooray! So, just saw that we just successfully posted our first, you know, Facebook post on uh, the Facebook uh, page, our Facebook account using the uh, social framework. Now, let's just try it again for the Twitter. So, let's just uh, click share on Twitter. So, there's a share, for example. Hey, what's up? friends like post and that posts it so if you're just going to our Twitter account so if we go into notifications not notifications uh, the home page so we uh, load that we have a new two uh, tweets sorry not two it's, we have a new tweet from sample account that was me actually hey what's up friends so you see this is uh, has the as social frameworks has posted the tweets into uh, the both Facebook and uh, Twitter so now we're gonna do uh, learn one more thing that is optional basically so you know uh, instead of uh, adding custom text about I mean uh, what I meant by custom text uh, text is uh, I mean custom text are images uh, if you just run your app and click on share on Facebook or you know share on Twitter any of these you just see that they are empty that they are empty so if you want to already my I mean by code if you want to already uh, you know uh, you know tell Swift to add in t uh, the text and image automatically by itself you can do that using the code I mean for both file, Facebook as well as Twitter so to do that you just say share to Facebook which is the SL Compose View controller uh, so let's just start by shadow Facebook. So I mean the shadow Facebook button. So as we know, we have declared a shadow Facebook as the compose view controller. I'm gonna say share to Facebook dot uh, set initial text. That's to set the uh, the post. So the, as it's an string, uh, I'm just gonna uh, mention the text inside these double quotes. Double uh, quotes. So I'm just gonna say the same thing. Hello, I posted using Swift and social framework okay then you can even add an image by the same share to Facebook dot add image and this needs a UI image property so I'm just gonna say UI image and our image view so it's UI image open uh, I mean, the parentheses and so that we have a parameter called as name so this is where you're gonna specify the name of the image 
since I don't have an image so let's just track one image uh, what I have uh, I see I have a bananas image so I'm just gonna drag it to my supporting files so uh, once you did that we have that so its name is 32.png so I'm just gonna type in 32.png okay so we uh, so this was to uh, set the uh, yeah even though add a custom image then you can even add a custom you know add URL so for that uh, you're gonna declare a NS URL and that says so this is not necessary so I'm just gonna basically not uh, uh, you know do the URL part because uh, most people don't use URLs or uh, so we're just gonna cover the inside initial text and add UI image add image property so let's just test these out uh, let's click on uh, share on Facebook and you see we have the uh, you know the automatically Swift has added the text inside which you have defined to code and the image as well so you can post that and it's gonna get posted on Facebook so refresh and here's it the image the image which we have posted where is it uh, it's not loading up so let's wait for this to load and this is the post hello I posted using Swift and social framework and this is the image basically you just see the thumbnail image okay now we can do the same thing for uh, Twitter so we're gonna say share to Facebook share to, sorry, share to Twitter dot uh, set initial text it's gonna be hello world for example then share to Twitter dot add image so now URL add image we uh, it needs which needs a UI image property Sorry, UI image, and and it has a parameter called name. Where you, you know, type in the name of the image. Now I'll just rerun this application. Uh, just a second. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, let's rerun this application. okay so we have this application in here so if I just click on share on Twitter and now we see we have the text as well as the image up here so we can post that up and let's go into Twitter and just refresh the page you see uh, we have the view photo option where you can view the photo here it is and the hello world uh, text so this was basically uh, uh, you know the end of our tutorial so I believe we have learned everything so uh, you know, this is it basically, which we can actually do with uh, social frameworks and other stuff. So this is it. So this is how you share your, you know, uh, your post or your images um, to Facebook or uh, Twitter using the social framework. So there's a separate video tutorial for sharing on Instagram, so you can just uh, view that. So it's in my playlist. So thank you guys. Uh, I'll just meet you guys in my other tutorials, so, hold on.